you know what I was doing a year ago right now? I was in my hotel room, in my bed, fast asleep. Oh, such fond memories. <laughs> Good morning guys, how y'all doing? <laughs> yes, a year ago today was the day I flew on home. <laughs> but right now, because it's 10 past 10 here, over there it's 10 past 2 in the morning, so I'll have been fast out. Anyway, I'm not going to keep going on about that. I'm going to sup some of my very large coffee. I need it. I'm on nights tonight. I wasn't last night because I had yesterday off and I was thinking of vlogging it. However, all I did was go to town to get my comic books and while I was there I actually found something I wanted. Doctor Who Series 10 for only £14.25 and it's in mint condition from the look of things. I guess I'll find out when I get around to watching it in about two years time. <laughs> that pile's getting ever so big. Whatever. And as I was walking around town I started getting a bit of a headache that became a proper headache by the time I got home so I didn't really do much. I played a lot of Fallout New Vegas I'll say that. I'm pretty sure I'm getting close towards the end of that game because Right now, the only mission I've got is the main one. There's no other missions. I can't find any other quests. I find one, and I complete it within like half an hour. But I did do something on Sunday, something that has been seven years waiting for me to do it. Really. I have a new front door handle. Have some of you just passed out? I think so. I nearly did from actually doing it. I got it for £8.99. $8.99 and I fitted it myself. Oh, some more of you have just passed out, haven't you? Ugh. <laughs> Trust me, I'm shocked in myself that not only did I sort it out, I actually did it myself. All these years, right, the door handle has been falling off. And I know it's been seven years because, as you know, I like to watch my videos back and I'm currently... Well, I just got to, just before I went to LA the first time, and on that, one of those vlogs, I was saying that my door handle's becoming loose. And I'm like, that was seven years ago. So that's why I decided it's time to sort it out. I mean, it's slightly different to the one that I had, but it works, it works fine. Let me show you. You ready for this? Oh, look at that. Doesn't fall off. And it works on both sides. What do you want? I'm not going anywhere yet. I am soon. Yeah, I'm very surprised of myself. Why has it taken me seven years? You know me, I'm lazy. Moving on to today, um, I've decided that I want to find a place. Remember, it was August now, wasn't it, when I was at Kate's wedding? On the way back, and I'm, I was slightly on the drunk side, so I don't know if I imagined it or it was really there, but I spotted a retail park on the way back home that I've never been to before. So I'm going to try and find it. It's been like itching at the back of my mind to go and well, go to it. So hopefully I didn't imagine it. <laughs> All I know is it's on the way towards Worksop, or it's in Worksop, or around that way anyway. So yeah, I'm gonna go look for that after I've had my big giant coffee. Okay, I found a place called Celtic Point. It's got an Asda and a few other shops. I'm not certain this is the place that I remember seeing on the way back from the wedding. I could swear that there was a retail park so I'm wondering if it's further on that way. <laughs> but I figured while I'm here, there are two charity shops, so I'm gonna have a look in them. I could swear I saw an actual big giant retail park. I am starting to think I imagined it. So much for that. I've just been to that charity shop. It says it's seized trading as of yesterday, 5 p.m. And this one doesn't open until Friday. Ugh. I don't know. Right. I was about to say I'm going to go that way, it says town centre, so it looks like I'm headed towards Worksop. 
So either I will find this supposed imaginary retail park or I'll end up in workshop if I do. I'm, I might go shopping there, I don't know. We'll see, I've got all day. I've got to have imagined it. I've found a retail park, I think it's called Sandy Lane Retail Park. It's got PC World, Pets at Home, a B&Q. But there's no way we drove past here. <laughs> was I more drunk than I thought I was? <laughs> Honestly, there is no way we'll have passed it because I'm pretty certain I'm almost in Worksop Town Centre. Ah oh, well, I'm I'm here now. I do want to go to PC World actually, so I'm gonna pop in there. But I just I don't know. I, I clearly remember seeing like a pets at home and lots of other buildings that look like a retail park. I'm well, I'm not 100% certain, but yeah, I'm 100% certain we never drove past here. There's a little bridge over there that I've dr just driven under. Never saw that. Unless, of course, I was that drunk, I don't remember seeing it. But I can't imagine... In fact, let me have a look at Google Maps. Where am I? I am, I'm literally up the road from Wakesop Town Centre. Once, that's why it's called Sandy Lane Retail Park, because the road is called Sandy Lane. There is no way, absolutely no way, we'd have come past here. Oh, I don't know. I'm seeing... I've just zoomed out a bit and straight away I'm seeing Langold. So maybe... Really? Is that road lead somewhere? Okay. It's possible. <laughs> maybe. Anyway. Enough of this speculating and imaginary <laughs> retail box. <laughs> Is that what I'm going to call this vlog? Imaginary retail park. Uh. But yeah, I'm gonna pop it to PC World, my win pets at home, and make a mental note not to rely on my memory from when I've been drinking because obviously it's not reliable. Well, that passed 10 minutes. <laughs> I went into pets at home first, got hardly some dog food and some dental sticks, and then I went into PC World to get some of these. I'd run out. $12.99 for 50. It's a bargain. Right, I now I've got to decide where I'm going to go next. I'm I'm done looking for this retail park that I'm. I'd, I think I'd rent it. <laughs> Unless this was it, and we somehow passed it. I don't know. The thing is, I've never ever been shopping in Workshop, so I might go do that. I'll just carry on looking for another retail park. <laughs> we'll see. So I decided to come into Workshop Town Centre, and. Um, Looks like there's a lot of shops. A heck of a lot of shops. I could be here all day. Oh well. I'm doing well already. Just been in this charity shop. Found a Dean Koontz novel that I don't have. Check my list to make sure that I don't already have it. You know what I'm like. Sometimes I buy something and find out I've already got it. So yeah, doing well already. Oh, another charity shop. I'm gonna have to go in. I'm a little confused. I've just been in game. And I'm always looking at Watch Dogs 2 and it's usually 12 99 or 2 for £20. However, in here, I found a deluxe edition for 6 99 So I'm, that's why I'm confused. Why is it cheaper? <laughs> they had some for like 12 99 in there. And they were the used ones. This one is brand new for 6 99 I'm having a very good shopping trip. Got myself another bargain. This calendar for £7. Everywhere I've been seeing them online, HMV, the £10. So yeah, happy I've got that. So right, for a second there I thought it was raining. It is rather gloomy. I really hope it doesn't rain. My coat's in the car. Can you guess why I'm smiling? That's why. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. Oh well. <laughs> oh, looks like I've run out of shops. Oh well. <laughs> Done pretty well, I think. So I'm gonna. Well, I've just turned around to go back to the car park. For starters, I've only got 40 minutes left on my ticket. Also, I can feel the temperature is starting to drop. And I haven't got my coat with me, so I've just zipped up my hoodie. Yeah, I'm gonna make my way back now. 
into the car park. But I have to say there's quite a lot of charity shops, I was surprised. It's a nice place to shop around. But unfortunately I'm not done with shopping yet. I've got to go to Crystal Peaks and Asda. And just like that I'm home. I just ran into Crystal Peaks, bought a few things, ran back out. Then I went to Asda, ran in for a few things and then back out. It was just food and cleaning things. <laughs> wasn't really worth vlogging. I'm worn out, <laughs> which is not a good thing because I'm off to work later on. I've enjoyed my long, long weekend. I booked Friday and yesterday off and I was intending to go out somewhere like Scarborough or wherever, but both days it was raining a lot. Those ideas just went out the window. <laughs> I'm gonna sign off now. I need to get this edited before I go to work tonight. Um, was there anything else I wanted to say before I signed off? I don't think so. All that's left for me to say is thank you for watching and subscribing if you have and liking this video if you did. Until the next time, peace out. Mm, it's 20 past four. What was I doing a year ago at this time? It'll have been 20 past eight in the morning. I'll have been eating breakfast and having a cup of coffee, which is a good idea. I need a coffee right now. <laughs>